Hi, welcome back to Computex 2011. We are here with Bill at Sapphire. Bill, we're going to talk AMD motherboards. Sapphire yes. is making a push on motherboards, and you've got a top to bottom line here. So talk us through them. Start with the low end. Okay, so I mean, Fusion is the, the big word at the moment, and uh, we're already shipping two models of our E350 uh, mini ITX board yeah, based on Fusion technology. Uh, this is the latest model, yeah. We launched with a fully featured model, um, but we found that some of our channel partners were looking for something with a little bit of cost taken out of it. So now we have what we call our white edition, uh, which is using a standard memory format, has a little bit less I.O. Cap capability than the original model, but still pretty fully featured and uh, ideal for an HTPC or an embedded market. Okay, so Fusion's still going strong. Uh, moving on from that, you've got a Lano board in the works. Now, there's quite a lot of buzz surrounding this board. What do you think of Lano as a platform? Well, we're pretty excited about it. I mean, obviously, it's giving us much more performance, particularly on the graphics side, and with all the extra cores it gives us, general performance will be really good too. So we're thinking this is pretty much going to attack a, a sector of the mainstream. Uh, we already have an ATX board designed. It's ready and working in our labs. Uh, we'll be on track for launching that uh, at release date. And um, we're going to be doing a mini ITX as well, following on the form factor of uh, the, the lower-end fusion boards. Yeah, the form factor for Lana seems to be as though Mini ITX is going to be ideal. It seems like it's going to be a great HTPC platform. Yeah, I agree with that. And uh, obviously, there's going to be a, a several different levels of performance of the APU. Um, so it's going to appeal to slightly different markets. Okay, so AMD's got some promise, upcoming promise in the mid range and low end, but you've also got something high end over there. Let's talk about the 990X. Well, yeah, we know uh, AMD's poised to launch its uh, bulldozer family of, uh, of CPUs, which is uh, going to be their first uh, eight core processor, yeah. and a whole family of products rolling out from that. So we already have our 990FX board uh, has been designed, and uh, we're ready for mass production for that for launch. Okay, you've got a hell of a lot of PCIe slots there. What configurations are possible on that board? Uh, pretty much anything, actually. <laughs> Um, yeah, we have a division of Sapphire that's uh, getting into things like digital signage and they need multiple graphics cards. So we can support that or we can support a whole load of I.O. with this board. Excellent. Okay, you've got AMD boards here and you also are making a push on mini PCs. You've been doing Intel Atom versions. Are we going to see AMD based mini PCs? Uh, yeah, that was our original concept, was to prove the format and uh, the desirability of a lifestyle product like that based on our original uh, Intel versions. But we have our Fusion design, it's pretty much done, we have it working in the lab, we'll be launching it in the coming months. Fantastic. Okay, stay tuned for more AMD products from Sapphire in the coming months, and check back for more from Hexus.